actually stole this from Abby's closet. Um, but Abby and I do share a love for jumpsuit. Um, uh, and the other thing that Remy does really beautifully is, is um, I like the, neck, the sort of uh, halter top neckline because I have smaller shoulders and then it sort of lets me celebrate them, pretend I have Nakara's shoulders, which I don't. Um, but uh, so Remy does just beautiful sort of drapey, easy feeling clothing that um, is nice for any, anybody to wear, all different shapes. And a woman's got to know her assets, so you know, you've got to be able yeah, to... that's right. <laughs> if, if your asset is your clavicle, go for it. You have three, four, five seasons ahead of you. Yes. How does it make you feel? Is it just such like sense of security as an actress? And just, it like, is a really interesting, it's never happened to me before. I mean, of course the sad news is we know it's ending. It ends at the end of season five. But the great news is, is that for fans and for the storytellers, we know what story we're telling. We have a very specific arc and journey for our characters to go on. And it's really made it a wonderful experience for all of us as creative people. Um, and I think it will be very satisfying to watch. Like when you go shopping, are you thinking, uh, oh my god, that's something Abby would wear? Or yeah. I, literally, it's like, oh, I can't wear that. Abby would wear that. One time I actually went shopping and there was this beautiful dress on sale, 70% off, and I was about to buy it and I was like, oh my God, this is an Abby dress. I called Cynthia. I said, this is a beautiful dress. It's 70% off. Abby will love this dress. They bought it. We fit it. I wore it. It looked great. <laughs>